Today, I am in the Loire Valley with David, our local agent, and he's going to present us this lovely property behind us. We've had the opportunity to take the mandate on this lovely property in the village of uh, Felevenus, which is probably only 10 minutes from the town of Richelieu, the historic town of Richelieu, and about 25 minutes from Chinon. So it's right in the heart of the Loire Valley. I personally love it. I have to tell last summer, I toured the Loire Valley, Chinon, Richelieu, yeah. Saumur with a motorcycles and friends and my girlfriend. And honestly, it's been absolutely, wow, <laughs> a blast. <laughs> Not only for the wines, of course, the yeah. wines of, between Chinon and Saumur yeah. are some of the best in France, if not the best. The houses, the, the people, everything, the food yeah. is absolutely amazing. So uh, let us show you a bit of that. Chinon is a town located in the Loire Valley and was once the site of a fortress and a palace. The region around Chinon is is known for its production of high quality red wines. Visitors can explore the vineyards, taste the wines and learn about the wine making process. The Loire Valley is famous for its numerous chateaux and the area around Chinon is no exception. Visitors can explore the Chateau de Chinon or visit nearby chateaux such as Azé le Rideau and Villandry. The area around Chinon is also known for its natural beauty with rolling hills, lush forests and scenic views of the Loire River. Hikers can enjoy many trails and walk through the picturesque towns and villages. Overall, the area around Chinon is a must-visit destination for anyone interested in history, wine, chateau or natural beauty. The benefit of this property is that it has a, an enclosed courtyard uh, which allows people to fill the privacy uh, of their own home. But in addition, the, the vendors have put in the swimming pool as well, which is a great draw, uh, especially for the long hot summers we get here. The house itself has uh, four good sized bedrooms, two bathrooms and a lovely lounge with a mezzanine and a huge fireplace which is just special. The circulation is around this courtyard with an, an open view on that side to really distant infinity view yes. on the landscape and c landscape picturesque scenery yes. of the countryside. It's the real wow factor when you come in through the gates and you look through and you can see the valley beyond. Yes, it's quite special. Also, the stones are quite special. It's called a uh, 4 Yes, it's, it's a lime-based stone, but what's so special I find for it I internally is that it's quite a neutral colour. So when people are doing interior design, it works really well. Honestly, the interior of what they've done, it's really... I love it. It's like shabby chic, something yes. like that. Yes. It's really warm, really warm and cosy. It gives a good family feel to the property.
I've seen a date on the fireplace, seven, uh, 1643. Yes. Dates back from 1643, yes. so it's a real piece of history that you're yeah. buying here. In terms of potential, what I see from experience, having filmed hundreds yeah. of properties, first, I, I love it. The exterior wall yes. with that lovely uh, closed uh, gate, which yes. is absolutely stunning. And yes. then on the right side, you've got a sort of uh, house that could be transformed probably yes. into a gite. You've got the benefit here of, of quite, quite a large um, number of dependances, which could be converted. Yeah, but the three of them, yeah. I mean, I count this as one, two, three, am I right? Yes, absolutely. I don't see the point of using it as a garage because honestly, you've got a uh, parking space in front parking. of it. You've, got a, you've also got a, a bread oven and also some land behind and some parking. So yes, ah. this doesn't need to be um, spot with cars parked in it at all. What do you think this house would be suitable for? What sort of project? Basically, it would work very well as a family home. Because of the enclosed courtyard, uh, it would work well as a good lock up and leave. So a second home, a holiday home as well. But also you've got the potential of creating a business here as well. We've got the large property, but as we've said, spoken earlier, the, the dependences that you could turn into accommodation, into studios, whether you want to do art. So what do people need to do if they are interested? They need to contact us at Leggett. If you want to buy it, yes. it's up to you. And uh, have a great day. Bye-bye. Enjoy. Take care.